How's it going? Not too shabby, man. How are you? Oh, so good. And you, you won the race. We did. We did. We won the freezer burn cup presented to me by my good friend Holler, given to the best bar at freezer burn, apparently. So, uh, yeah, I think we did pretty well this year, considering it was our first year out with the new units. I, I think you did so well. And with freezer burn, there are many projects that are volunteer based. They are community based, based on art grant funding and building a team. It was uh, kind of hard to go in to, to get enough labor to help us out, but really myself and my buddy uh, Ryan, we did most of the work and definitely most of the, the funding up front, but it wasn't just the two of us. We did have a fair amount of help from a number of our friends. Great to kind of pull together and then pull out something from the community for the community. It, it takes a vision and a dream and a lot of sweat. And, and this thing, it, it goes on wheels, it goes on the highway. It is a, a DJ booth, it is an, an experience. So should we go take a look? Let's check it out. Let's yeah. check it out. What do the neighbors think? Uh, well, I did get a parking ticket and there was a bylaw officer here like three days in a row just making absolutely sure that I was within the legal limit of parking here. But uh, I think they were quite happy to see us go when we were done building it. <laughs> it's a curiosity for sure. Rave round two. What is your next rave round two? Uh, it's a little, another little burner event, not nearly as official. It's called Ferning Man out near Fernie. Let's see if this thing can get through Fresno's Pass. I, I know it's not under construction, but... Can, can we, you just walk us through sure, the sure. elements of this? Yeah, I mean, well, this is, you know, the cockpit where uh, mostly just the driving happens. Can't say there's a lot of action up here while we're partying in it. We got the lounge area here. When it's all up and running, this is the periscope, so you can see what's going on outside. To the back, there's the bar on the right-hand side. We can serve two full, full kegs of beer, fully pressurized, and uh, that's pretty sweet. We got this whole table here, mostly just for hanging out, drinking. And in the back, we've got our whole PA system. It's an old turbo sound rig. For anyone who has partied in Calgary a lot, the old burner events you see with the Legion, this was the upstairs sound system. We got a killer deal on these things, and they sound awesome. It was a game, I remember. Yes. It was Plinko, right? Yes, it was. Yeah, so this is Brian's uh, baby, and he had the idea to have Drinko. Uh, our friend Kat also brought a bunch of pogs, and so you drop a pog into it, and then it selects a drink for you. I was trying to interview you at Freezer Burn, but I, I couldn't track you down. I, I hadn't met you or your crew before. I tried to chase down the mustaches <laughs> in Calgary to get this final segment of who won the rave. And I, I was recently at a fundraiser for Frog Fest, and I found this, and I wanted to present this to you because how many mustaches does it take? At least four. So there's four of them. And this is the Beatles yellow submarine. Do you want to relabel that? Do a quick little upgrade on that guy. Yeah. There we go. Yes. <laughs> That's great. Congrats to the submarine. Thank you very much. Yeah, safe travels. <laughs> Thank you.